view and clouds today. So picture perfect. Look at these clouds. So the park is getting very busy now. I, I completely forgot to uh, mention something. The whole reason for those of you who um, are new to Civil War stuff, uh, by the way, I'm I'm here uh, again on Little Round Top on July the second, and the whole reason that the uh, Round Top happened, uh, the attack on or battle for Round Top, Little Round Top, is because of that darn Sickles, that darn Dan Sickles, who much like uh, Francis Channing Barlow, was also a political general. And uh, as I mentioned in the, I, I posted a video on this a while ago, um, I think last fall, I was walking right down Crawford Ave, but um, Dan Sickles was posted to this area right here, and in the mid-afternoon he decides to move across this uh, very slight ridge where you see this first tree line, and to uh, basically advance just beyond there, you can't really see it from here. <clears throat> Um, into an area um, more or less known as the Peach Orchard. And that's how the fighting at the Peach Orchard began spread out to the wheat field. Um, and that battle actually lasted um, just a little bit later than Round Top. Round Top uh, ended around 7. And uh, the wheat field was done around 7.30 on July the 2nd. And, uh, you know, you can't blame Sickles for everything on this side of the battlefield, but... Um, that there was certainly um, a very high uh, casualty rate in the uh, in the wheat field, and um, and he does he definitely gets some of that credit. Um, so that's why this area was left um, again not absolutely empty, but you know more or less vacant because he advanced um, more or less against orders. You know he did try to um, contact the superior a couple times, but but more or less against orders, he advanced to just beyond that tree line um, and it left this area uh, exposed and that's when uh, Governor Warren came up and, and realized what was going on and then got uh, Strong Vincent's guys and uh, and with Chamberlain and um, the rest of the gang, they, they held folks off until about 7 o'clock. Just gorgeous. Gonna have to leave eventually, but I'm I'm afraid to leave because I'm afraid that, that getting a spot later is gonna be pretty tough. At least uh, in this part of the battlefield where um, most of day two's fighting happened. Um, again, over there at Devil's Den, up here on Little Round Top across the way, across that tree line and the, the peach orchard and the wheat field. Uh, fun fact, the peach orchard is now an apple orchard. But I guess back then it had peaches. Now it's not that there was absolutely no fighting until the late afternoon on the second, but the reason why um, most of the day's fighting didn't pick up until then was because as with so many other times that I've read now um, Lee, Lee was really really slow to get his attack together and the Federals kind of didn't mind at this point because they had a lot more people coming in 
um, they they'd been reinforced with uh, you know many more divisions, um, probably a couple more corps at that point, and they knew that they had this high ground. Um, but, you know, of course, this is the extreme left flank, but they knew that they had you know the areas between uh, kind of between uh, Culp's Hill and 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 you know the bottom of Cemetery Ridge. So the Union didn't mind so much, but but like I've said so many times that I've read before now, uh, I think that was the case in Antietam. Lee was just having a, the darndest time uh, getting set up and coordinating his men. There was confusion in the orders and in the plans. Um, in this case, on day two, Longstreet was taking forever because, um, well, he got started late, and then he had to countermarch a bit. So that's why things didn't kick off until they did middle afternoon and um, between uh, Culp's Hill and uh, the wheat field then you know pretty much uh, went till sundown uh, hour before sundown over by the uh, the wheat field and certainly till sundown at Culp's Hill I may make make that one of my stops today if I can find a parking spot but till the next one.